as a faculty member on the campus, you know, part of our, our um, part of our contributions to the campus is not just to, you know, sort of do our jobs, but also to serve the campus. I kind of started building, I guess, a reputation for being a, uh, a, a gamer and being a very avid person that jumped into those kinds of opportunities. In 2015, we had a group of students that wanted to form a competitive gaming club, and I was asked to be one of the co-advisors for the club. Once SUNY kind of did their, their tournament, that first tournament, the Chancellor's Tournament, back in the spring of 2020, then all of a sudden there was a, a kind of a, a wave to get us into competition and, and get us, you know, um, into more sustainable teams. On our campus, there's a huge culture of certain games. And so now I can kind of pull those people from our campus that are playing and say, hey, be on our team. Being a woman in the gaming community is pretty much like it is in any space where a woman is considered to be a minority. You have to have tough skin um, because at any moment you're going to have to prove yourself. At any moment somebody will ask for your creds um, to see if you're actually allowed to be in that space. It's silly though, because women make up nearly half of the gaming community. It needs to not be news anymore that there's a girl in the room. In the communities that I have impact over, um, you know, I make it very clear that any of that kind of gatekeeping behavior is not going to be tolerated. You know, I, I love seeing women succeed in a space that has not been the most welcoming for them. That would be one of the biggest goals for me is to really increase our diversity on our on our teams. I hope that esports and gaming in general will gain more legitimacy as a sport um, and as a valuable hobby. It's not a vice, it's challenge. Raising the bar of, of the competition, you know, how it's categorized. Um, I think will also help with funding and support for students that want to engage in this in this of competition. Big hope.